Hi everyone, it is January 30, 2015. I have to let go of the idea that nothing can shock me anymore because I am shocked every single day. I want to thank the subscriber who dropped this link in a comment below one of my videos. I, I cannot believe what I am about to show you. And I'm posting this video particularly for parents with children in public school. If you don't know what Common Core is, if you don't know what your teachers are actually teaching your children, I really do hope that you get on it right away and find out what is going on. Read their textbooks, get involved, scrutinize what these teachers are teaching your children. You might be horrified. Now, Manufacturing Satanism, a personal memoir. I, <laughs> Satanism and the sexualization of children. I posted a video on the sexualization of children uh, not too long ago and recommended everybody watch a video that was horrifying to me. And you're listening to someone who's not a prude. But there is a time and a place for everything. And public school teachers should not be teaching children about how to have sex. Okay? That just should not be happening. But what is taking place in our public schools today, under the Common Core curriculum, which is so unbelievably sick and twisted, that I, I cannot believe that it's, it's continuing. And I cannot believe that we don't have parents outraged and demanding that this Common Core curriculum end. Get rid of it. They are warping your children into little sex slaves, into slaves for the corporate elite, please, please, if you have not researched, if you've not done the work to find out about Common Core, please do that. Okay, so here it is. I, I, I'm sure you'll be as shocked as I am. What do you say about this? What do you say about this? Explicit? What, what the hell is... We have become such a profoundly sick and twisted society. 11 and 12 year olds get a sex toy lesson in Nebraska. A teacher is shown demonstrating the use of a strap-on dildo. She has her buttocks thrown up over her head showing how to insert the dildo into the desired orifice. Are you taking this in? Are you taking this in? Now what the hell is wrong with this adult? How sick and twisted is this adult? Parents, please, if you have public school children, please find out what is happening in your schools. I'm not going to read the article. I'm just going to actually, I'll link below to all of the articles, but I'm going to point out some more articles. Lawmaker, Common Core testing company forces children to become as homosexual as they possibly can. All of it, this is just about so hypersexualizing children. Controversy and poor pervade Common Core curriculum. This is a wonderful article, and I do hope certainly that everybody reads it, but if you are a parent with a child in public school, please read this. Please read this. Okay, Common Core Sex Education teaches masturbation, sex, and abortion through pornographic drawings and presentations. Ever since Common Core was implemented into the public school system, it has been welcomed with open arms by some and rejected by others. Who could possibly, who could possibly welcome this with open arms? It is Communist Core. Common Core. Just think about the name. Common Core. Standardizing all kids in the United States. National standards for all of your children. Common Collective, the Collective Communist. It is 
a communist curriculum. Please do the research if you don't know what I'm talking about. It is communist core. <laughs> All right, another one. Imagine if you found a sex ed poster asking this provocative question at your daughter's middle school. Middle school. Middle school poster. In their school. How do people express their sexual feelings? Oral sex? Sexual fantasy? Caressing? Anal sex? Dancing? Hugging? Touching each other's genitals? Kissing? Vaginal? Whatever. Okay, and you can watch this video and you can listen to the woman who is just, you know, perfectly fine with it. This is part of the, the uh, Common Core curriculum, um, national, and this is perfectly fine. Are you kidding me? 13-year-olds, this is what the schools are teaching? This is what's going on? Chicago, we need to teach sex education in kindergarten in kindergarten classrooms, sex education, kindergarten. Parents are permitting this? Really? See, I, I don't even believe that any sex education should be in public school. It's the parent's job. That's their responsibility. You know, they teach their kids about morality and and sex, they get the birds and bees talk and everything. But no, now the schools are are taking this job over in, in kindergarten? Kindergarten. But they're not only taking it over. This is what they're doing. This is what adults in public school are actually doing. So how sick and twisted do we have to become before parents get outraged and stop this? Um, you know, I, I've posted videos on my old, uh, my original Kafka Winston World channel, as well as this one about parents being arrested at school board meetings. But what happens is, well, in this one particular case, it was a, this man a, <laughs> right here, and I will link below to this video. Um, a William Bear in New Hampshire spoke out of turn at a school board meeting over, he was outraged that his nine-year-old daughter was reading this book that 19 minutes, it's so just sexually graphic. And he went above his 10-minute speaking limit. Then he gets arrested, pulled out of the meeting by a cop, and all of the other parents just sit, say nothing. Every parent should have been outraged by the fact that this cop was taking that parent out. Why do people not stand up? Because that is what is causing the horrific breakdown in morality in this country. That is what is transforming our country. That is what is manifesting the nightmare that we're living. People not standing up. They're treated, they're so unbelievably demoralized, infantilized, that they just sit in their chair and they take their orders from the school board meeting and from the school board, whoever is sitting on it. You can only speak for 10 minutes. You can't ask any questions. You can, you can share your opinion and we're going to do nothing with it, but we're just going to allow you two minutes to get your yayas out and then we're going to go and do whatever the hell we want to do. Parents aren't even being listened to at all. So how do you change that? You change that by all parents getting up and demanding that things change. You demand the right to set the rules of the board that you pay. You're paying their salaries. 
You demand. You take over. You find the power within yourself and not let these board members rule the day. And you get rid of Common Core. You get rid of this sick, twisted curriculum that is warping the minds of American students today. What did Vladimir Lenin say? What, what was that quote? Just give me one generation and I can transform the world. That's what's happening here. You've got to save these children. Now, I'm just talking about the sexual <laughs> uh, component of Common Core. There's a whole lot of components to Common Core that are indoctrinating children with lie after lie after lie. Climate change, much of the literature has to do with, oh, you know, you, guilting them into being very careful with their carbon footprint. Anti-Americanism. Some of the literature that kids are reading actually proclaim Barack Obama as this messianic figure. Please check out what your kids are being taught. Please. And please stand up for them. They deserve it. I will link below to all of these articles, and I sure do hope that you all circulate it.